The following bout is brought to you by the sports doctor, Dr. John Maroof, and is set in the oh. XFN middleweight division with three three-minute rounds of action. Introducing first, Freddy in the blue corner. This mixed martial artist stands at six feet, four inches tall. He weighed in at 185 pounds. He enters this fight with an amateur MMA record of one win and one loss and fighting out of American Top Team Davy in Cooper City, Florida. He is Jonathan the Boogeyman Forby. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This mixed martial oh, artist party. stands at six feet tall. He weighed in at 179 pounds. He is making his amateur MMA debut and fighting out of Pembroke Pines, Florida. He is Max Chagdusi. The free assigned to this fight, Ray Ramos. Max Jagdasing and Jonathan Forming finally underway. Cooper City versus Pembroke Pines, a rivalry as old as just now. Both guys meet in the middle. ATT Davey Baga trained. Jonathan Forming. We're going to be careful in a grappling situation because uh, pockets in fight shorts are illegal for a reason. Do not want to get a finger stuck in those. Jonathan, Jonathan Forbing. Jadison has a very unorthodox style. Yeah, it's like uh, he moves like uh, Do if Dominic Cruz couldn't wrestle. And right to mount, go Jonathan Forbing. That's a tall dude to have on top. If he postures up, it's going to be bad. It's going to be old. He's not even trying to posture up. He just got the just got the old, old Saturday night ride on, just throwing some uh, knuckles to the temple. I don't know why I'm, I'm, I'm amused by this fight. I shouldn't be amused, but this fight's amusing to me. Yeah. I think it's the long way before. I don't know what it is. Yeah. It kind, of, kind of took the air out of the room, honestly. Yeah. I mean, things were flowing. Yeah. Oh, we, nice hips down by Forbing. We need a spinning wheel kick knockout in here to pop them back up. Yeah, Forbing's a, yeah, definitely a lot of man to have on top of you. Yeah, man. He's long. There, That's what I'm talking about. Just maybe looking to end this thing quickly here with some ground and pound. I mean, that arm triangle's been there all night for Forbing. I think Ray Ramos is about to say, that is all that she is wrote. It. Yeah. Yeah. And a, uh, just a long guy to have mounted on top of me. It's not a fun place to be. And uh, don't, again, no, no info sheet on Max Jackson here. So I'm not quite sure. In the background is Jim. Uh, you can shave. Like may need a gem that can uh, sharpen those tools for him a little bit. But um, Jonathan Foreman, again, a blue belt out of ATT Davey, that's going to make him a, a baga trained grappler. It's going to be hard to shake off a mount anyway, but with that kind of, that kind of length, and he can very, very easily posture up with his feet crossed under your, under your butt, man. That's uh, a. Yeah. That you can get. You can get these. And length is one of them. Length is one of them. But if you teach length leverage, you got a real problem on your hands. 100%. And, uh, you know, that's, uh, that's probably going to be a way that other fights play out for Jonathan Forbing, if I had to guess. So that guy makes it in his mouth. He's got such a long face to not get swept, you know, not get rolled. And uh, pretty good looking hips. And if that guy can posture up, man, those are, he can get some real, real power on those punches. And uh, kind of surprised they go with the arm triangle. Yeah, I have too. He was in the perfect position when he got the paint down. Yeah. Okay, but hey, whatever. He wanted to maintain mount those strikes, and he did just that. So, uh, excellent show in there for Chuck. Yeah, I don't know what's so amusing about that. I think you're right. It's the, it was a, it was a five-minute build-up. Um, 
before the fight. So, let's make this one official. Referee Ray Ramos stops the fight at two minutes, 30 seconds of round number one. Your winner by TKO out of the blue corner, Jonathan the Boogeyman Forby. I'm here with your winner, the Boogeyman, Jonathan Forbing. Uh, ATT, uh, uh, Baga Train's going to be a hard mount to get out of anyway. And you got a lot of a, a lot of length and a lot of uh, a lot of leverage on top. Kind of a weird, uh, um, unconventional stand-up style. But once you got on top, it was uh, it was just mount for days. Um, so take a minute, talk us through it. What do you think about the fight, man? Besides the, you're uh, trying to cool you off here, trying to ice the kicker. Uh, damn, that was a lot of fun. Uh, I just want to thank my team, you know, Baga. That guy's kind of crazy, but I love it. <laughs> TJ, Mateus, Mauricio, my coaches. I wouldn't be anywhere without them. Uh, all my teammates, all the black belts, Spader. <laughs> Thanks, Spader. <laughs> uh, Simeon, I know you're watching this. And uh, I'll see you later, man. <laughs> all right. I saw that's all he's got to say. He's, he's a pretty happy guy. You want to go celebrate. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Jonathan Forming.